December 5, 1969. Four universities. Four computers. One network that would change human civilization forever. This is the day the internet was born. UCLA? October 29, 10.30 p.m. Student programmer Charles Klein tries to send the first message to Stanford. He types login. The L transmits. The O transmits. Then crash. The first message ever sent between networked computers. Low. Like hello, but accidental. An hour later, they got the full word through. By November 21st, UCLA and Stanford had a stable link. Then came UC Santa Barbara. Then the University of Utah. Each site ran totally different operating systems. Different computers. Stanford had Douglas Engelbart's revolutionary hypertext system the guy who invented the computer mouse. UCLA had Leonard Kleinrock's network measurement center. Utah brought Ivan Sutherland's graphics work. They deliberately chose incompatible systems to prove packet switching could connect anything. December 5, 1969, all four nodes operational. The network was alive. By 1971. 15 nodes? By 1975. Declared operational. By 1990. Decommissioned because it had evolved into something bigger, the internet. Every email you send. Every video you watch. Every Google search. Exists because four universities connected four computers 55 years ago. That's December 5, 1969. The day everything changed. Subscribe for inventions that created the modern world.